They managed to get like an actual ad. ad. The white glare of the blank page in front of me hurt my eyes. My hands began to shake uncontrollably. There's someone behind you, Wake. Hey, Wake, you stay here. I'm gonna go see what's up. You just keep doing what you're doing. Be cool, okay? Yeah, I'll be cool. I didn't know what the chaos was all about, but it could be my only chance of getting out of here. Where the hell did he get a damn hammer? I don't know. Oh, afraid of the crazy brothers, are ya? Not so weak now. Are we? Yep, the Anderson brothers have gone well, crazy. Fast, aren't they? <laughs> nah. Sinclair looked bad. That wasn't a love tap. The crazy old fart hit her hard. And if she was one of Hartman's store, goons, she had it coming. It. I could get the key to the office wing from Sinclair. The backstage. I had is to get to Hartman's yours, office. He had taken all my manuscript destiny. pages. That's where he'd be keeping them. Go to Hartman's office. Oh, okay. Come out and face the music, Birch. It's time to pay the piper. This is getting creepier and creepier by the minute, and need I say why? The markings on the tape said they were recordings Hartman had made at the sessions with his patients. I saw Alice's name on one of them. For a moment, I couldn't breathe right. Now, Mrs. Wake, can you tell me about Alan's problems? <laughs> he's more and more out of control all the time. The parties, he's so angry all the time. He's getting violent, he's... Do you mean with you? No. Just get him here, I'll absolutely do my very best. Yeah, but doctor, you need to be careful with him. He's not just going to listen to you and cooperate. He's the most stubborn man I've ever met. Well, I'll be sure to bear that in mind. Hearing her voice, what she was saying made me happy and sick and guilty all at once. Worst of all, I recognized the words. The phone call from her. It had been a cut-up of this. Just a recording. Something tells me I don't want to be in this room anymore because all of the paintings look like things that I've seen in the game, except for that. And maybe that. Oh, and those, I think. Yeah, but look, look, it's like the Taken. What else? Like the darkness and all that? This guy, it looks like the hitchhiker, looks like me. The photo on the wall caught my attention. In it, the clinic staff was standing outside the lodge. I knew the man next to Hartman. He was the kidnapper. Hartman had been playing me all along. Hartman, do you hear me? I'm gonna sue your crazy quack ass to shred! Seriously! Do you have any idea how much trouble you're Barry? in? Barry? Ow! About time! Barry! Man, am I glad to see you. We need to get to Hartman's office. It's right next door. You okay? Yeah. I mean, no! The cops found me at Rose's trailer, but they didn't hassle me too much. I'm obviously a victim in this, and I demanded to be treated as such. Or else I'd sue their asses. Speaking of asses, that
That Fed gave me a real hard time, but I had no clue where you were. That guy's crazy, Al. But he let me okay, go. Enough talking. And then I get a call from Hartman that way too much dialogue in this bitch. episode already. <sighs> a flashlight and a gun. These oh, were all the pages I had already, and more. Where do you keep those? Alan, oh. please. You're sliding back Sh into the- Tell me one more lie and I'll shoot you in the face. Ah, well, it was worth a shot. Really, Wake, come on. Let's work together on this. You have no idea- Parker, shut up! Barry, get out of here. I'll catch up with you. Get a car. Oh, Al, let's just- Go! Wake, listen to me. This is a mistake. Don't you see? Together we can create something absolutely wonderful with your ability and mine. She's here. And he's dead. I gotta escape from the crazy place. Ah, well, I don't have my flashlight. Damn it. Would be on me in a moment. I had to find a way out. If I had my. I'm not going in there. Come on, 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 quick. The light's gonna break. Damn it. I needed light to get the possessed bookshelves out of my way. Well, there's a lamp here that's still working, if you can use it. There. Ow! Okay. Well, there's a lamp here that's not, you know, working. That's working. Okay, maybe I need to go up this way and get the generator working. Yes, there we go. Whoops. Whoops, whoops. And ta-da! Oh, I need to do that. Oh, I need to do it again. Okay. Or else they'll keep coming back. I think. Yeah, they are gonna- yeah! No, they're flinging themselves. Okay, again, whoops. Whoop, one, two, three. And that should get more of them out of the way. I don't want it to be like a, like a melee or something. Okay, so I'm just gonna leave this light on for as long as I can. So everything down there is dead. That should work. One, two, three. Okay. Go, 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 go. Quick with the lights up, run. Everything else in the room is kind of dead. Okay. No. Is the TV gonna come on? Oh no, there's a manuscript page here. Okay, never mind. One hell of a storm is kicking up around this place. We gotta get out of here. Or not. I don't like the look of that ball. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh! Oh dear. Come on. Jeez. Come get me. He's up down the hallway, like that. Bye, Dark Presence! 
I'm running! Oh dear. Hi! Oh, jeez. Oh, it broke the doors. How wonderful. Ow! You have a flashlight, Barry! Uh Thank goodness. I found the car, but the gate's locked. You're gonna have to go through the hedge maze over there! Wonderful. Barry, I don't have a light. Take this, Al! Is she oh, gonna God. be safe without that? Look at the house, Al! Look out! Holy jeez! <laughs> 